Hi friends, today in this video, I am going to make a necessary electronics tool, using simple triple 5 timer IC. This tool will be very helpful for every home, and also for electronic hobbyists. I first prepared the simple circuit diagram for this circuit, using a triple 5 timer IC as main component, with some other few components for this circuit. Then I converted the schematics into the PCB. For easy assembly I ordered PCBs from JLC PCB. Get 1 to 8 layer PCBs for just $2, efficient large scale production reduces costs, and bringing you PCBs in unbeatable prices. And then I prepared the PCB for its components. So, let's place all the components into the PCB according to the circuit diagram. After completing the soldering process, I cleaned the PCB with isopropyl. And our PCB looks nice and clean. Before any further ado, let me tell you that you can also order the same PCB for this project, without messing up on prep board. Just go to the video description, and with this link sign up on JLC PCB website. JLC PCB provides easy, affordable, and reliable PCB and PCBA solutions, empowering electronic engineers to develop projects efficiently. Just upload your Gubber file here, to get instant quote and order in minutes, it is easy as online shopping. After uploading, you can see the preview of the PCB. You can also change quantity and color of the PCB as per your requirements. Quality and lead time is reliable, all-in-house production, ensuring stability and strict quality control in every process, and lightning fast PCB production, in just 24 hours. And then you can save to the cart for the checkout process. Also don't miss JLC PCB's 6-layer PCB special, get $30 off with a coupon, and enjoy top quality 6-layer PCBs, plus 2 UENIG finish, and no engineering fees for wire-in pads. Now back to the project, use triple 5 timer IC, and insert it into the IC base. Use alligator clip wires, and connect into this input terminal connector. Use multimeter testing probes, and connect into this output terminal connector. And here our circuit is ready for testing. Use a 9 volt battery, and connect with input of the circuit. And this is powered on. I used multimeter to show you the input, and output voltage of this circuit. As you can see input is 9.5 volts, and output is boosted to 22.3 volts without any inductor coil. Now let's test with this LED bulb.
You can also test different voltage LEDs too. You can also use multimeter to track the voltage for Zener diode testing, and connect probes at output connector. You can also test different voltage of LEDs. You can test everything under the range of 24 volts maximum. You can also increase input voltage to 15 volts, to get output up to 40 volts for testing different components. This tester is helpful and handy, also can be operated on 9 to 15 volts input supply. Also it can be used to check Zener diode as well as rectifier diodes. That's it for today. For more useful videos, subscribe this channel. Also check out these recommended videos. Thanks for watching.